Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of my name. It's Molly back on the Don't Starve and just continuing right where we left off. We are going to go get some reeds so we can make that bird pretty much. Okay, now it's night time. I gotta be really careful. Um, you know, though there's, you know, no monsters like, uh, I mean, there's no spiders or hounds after me. There are still going to be those. Oh, ah! <laughs> those, um, those thingies. I forgot what they're called. I don't know if this thing auto equips, so I'm gonna go ahead and just hold it over it, but I'm not gonna equip this thing. We'll, we'll see if it does it. Alright, so I gotta go just straight down. Okay, let's see. Auto equip, please! Okay, it does. Woo! Just checking, just checking. Okay, let's go. Almost morning, we're all good. So this is gonna give me some sanities. Both of these. Wow, you can light this up, huh? Alright, and when it hits morning as well, the frogs should pop up and perhaps I'll just kill them. Um, it's really, I mean, they're an okay source of food, not the greatest, but you can still give them to the pigs and have them help you out. Get out of the way! Alright, don't need to wear this anymore. Okay, where are we? Um, I haven't really explored this whole area. Where does this take me again? Oh, yeah, there, it takes me up here. Oof, so there's no easy way back home besides just straight out running back. I should probably, yep, yeah, okay. That looks good down here, and I'll be also exploring some new areas. Alright, so where are the frogs at? Surprised they didn't pop up. Is it because they are in the swamp? Oh god, really? Uh, I don't have the umbrella! Gotta be careful. I didn't even know trees can um, grow on these things. Like, you know, I know you could probably plant them, but I didn't know you can... What to call them? That they grow here innately. Glama, you help me with my sanity, please? If I get wet to a certain amount, though. Glomer won't help at all. And, uh, why would you call Glomer ugly, guys? And one person did. I, I really forgot the name. I'm sorry. <gasps> what? Oh, this is perfect. Okay. Please let me fight some of these guys. Dang it. Darn it. I was hoping to fight one of these, um, one of the clockworks so it can actually get more, um, you know, more, uh, thingamajiggies. More gears. There we go. Sorry. Oh, I think we'll, I think we'll take this thing out, too. It's, it's not near home, so who cares a crap. Oh, Glama! Oh, shit. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, pick my weapon. Alright, it's on. Let's go, bro! Go! One, two, three. Perfect. Whatever they give me, that's fine. This is great. This is good. Hiya! It's only level one, too, so we're not going to get those jumping ones, which is nice. And we also get a monster meat that we can either feed to, um... We can either feed to the, uh, the pigs. Or, feed to the bird, so it's all good. And we also need some silk, just, it's great to have a small amount and stuff. Oh, only give me one? Two, okay, that's great. Um, I think what we'll do as well is grab this marble. We do have, like, some marble things that our mod pack can handle, I think. I, I don't, I'm not too, I don't remember, but anyway, we're grabbing it. Oh my god, I see you right there. Dun, 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 dun. Man, look at that, I'm near Glomer, but my sanity is like, neutral right now. Yeah, if I get a little bit closer to him though. Oh, the music is so catchy! I love it! Oh, I think broke, huh? Alright, let's craft another one. Marble! Marble, marble, marble. What can I craft with marble um, that is useful? Well, we have the marble flooring. Um, along with the mod, um, you know, better flooring, um, it could give us a benefit. As to which kind of benefit it is, I absolutely do not remember. I just know that the wood one provides some sanity, while the um, the wool one, made out of beefalo wool, provides some sort of insulation. So other than that, um, I'm pretty sure marble might help with something. I mean, it does seem like a very hard to get material, so I don't see why not. Maybe it cools you down. I don't know. Alright, so we have we definitely have enough reed. We're gonna run back home now. I might as well grab the rest of these. Not in a total rush, but it'd be nice to get back home and cook some of this stuff and make sure that we're good to go. Freaking mosquitoes. Mosquito Oh perfect green mushrooms as well. Perfect Mwah! with the sanity. Why did I do that? Um Okay. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give wow, even more. This is awesome. Alright, now a lot of people have been asking me, uh, we, 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 um, we have this conversation quite a lot, uh, with the viewers, 
which is, um, you know, why don't you play with mods? And then there's the other thing. Why don't you... Why are you using mods? It's really stupid and cheap. And other people go, no, it'll make the fun a lot more interesting. I've seen too much of vanilla. Here's the thing. I, I, I've done both playthroughs before. I've done a crap ton of regular vanillas, which I just played all the updates and talked about them and just, you know, played like that. And then I've done some updates, which has been totally heavily modified, which makes the game almost not even like Don't Starve. Some people may even call it unbalanced and cheap, but that's the point. Oh, God. That's the point of a um, modded run. You don't want to play the same game. You want to spice it up a bit, you know? And then, you know, I come to this conclusion. I, I, I just can't live without mods. Mods are like really what... It, it, it keeps the game afloat. And by that, and now like not only you know game wise, like oh it's fun for me, but it also keeps the game itself, like selling, you know online, all that good stuff. Um, it's a huge replayability. Think of Minecraft. Sure, Minecraft is great on its own, you know, vanilla, lots of building and all that stuff. But mods, it's what kept me playing for years after the game came out. Um, so yeah. So wh what I'm trying to do, um, and this is an experiment on this playthrough as well is I want to do a combination of... Okay, basically I want to make a vanilla plus type of playthrough. Whenever, oh god, you freaking turkey face! Um, yeah. So I want to do mods that are not OP, but they also change the game up in one way or another, whether it be adding a new type of monster, some new, um, you know, some new building stuff that is not too game breaking, stuff like that. So, you know, as of this moment, we have stuff like, you know, the green cap. I mean, not the green cap. We have the um, the display item values. That doesn't, that's not cheap, right? I mean, if you really wanted to know um, a value of an item, you go online and look it up. All right, let's go ahead and add a couple of water logs on here and get me a little bit heated up. Choo! Put some stuff away as well. My sanity's going low. I think we're gonna cook these green caps to eat it. And let's go ahead and begin making our birdhouse. Put this in here as well. Um, don't have that much food. Okay. Cook these and we'll cook this. But yeah, uh, vanilla plus. Um, I'm working on, you know, of course when this um, particular playthrough ends and we start a new one, because, you know, believe it or not, this. Uh, the Reign of Giants DLC is pretty much almost complete, and once it's fully, fully, like, updated release, no more new content, maybe a few bug fixes here and there, that's when I'll do a full-on playthrough and make that one, like, a hundred episodes long just for you guys, and, um, that's when we'll, uh, I'm, I'm trying to, like, tweak my mod pack. Remember, Vanilla Plus, meaning nothing too crazy, but changes up the game, so it's pretty noticeable. Alright, blue mushrooms. Does this give me, uh... I hate these things, they're so bad. Get out of here. Okay, so that thing does give me a good amount of health and hunger, but my sanity. And I have no way to increase my sanity at the moment. Besides sleeping, which I don't want to do. So, let's go ahead and grab these seeds. I have the reeds. Let's make some paper. Two paper, I believe. Papyrus. Should we get my sanity up by 15? Pretty awesome. Pretty good. Papyrus. There we are. I didn't see nothing pop up. Did I do it right? Structures. Yeah, there you go, birdcage. Uh, here's hoping that the birdcage does not go up in flames like everything else that I'm gonna t going to have. That would be really, really upsetting if it just like, poofs, blows up in summer. So now we just have to catch a birdcage. I should put a bird in it. Hell yeah, let's do that. Put these things away. Um, so my inventory is a real mess right now. And I think uh, as soon as it hits morning, we will chop down a lot more trees. Let's see, I have some planted here. We're going to chop these down, get the pine cones, replant them, and then chop all these down and, you know, pretty much open all this area. Besides, um, when the pigs go all crazy during dusk, we'll check this area for even more ice because ice is very much needed. Uh, all right, so five monster meat. This is going to be good. Monster meat's great. And I need, to, yeah, need to actually eat. You need to make a bird cage, but I'll do that later once we have, you know, time to just chill out here. Right now, we should focus on getting all that good stuff. Alright, so anything I need to just put away? Oh, I have so much grass. Look how much grass I have. I have way too much grass. So I'll leave one here. Um, I can leave the silk. Uh, I can leave the cut reeds. Keep this with me. Leave the torch here. I'll put the torch in the ground, actually. Alright, we, we have to hurry because there's not too much time to spend out here with the pigs. So, um, let's go ahead and just do this. Alright. I think I hear puppies too, which is great, because, you know, um, the pigs should be able to help me out now. 
Um, here's hoping though that they aren't fire ones or else the pig's houses are going to get de totally de you know, demolished. And once that happens, I have no choice but to build another house for them. So, oh, look at that. Yeah, the, the days are starting to get a lot longer. Which means, yes, uh, I feel, I feel summer coming right up. Look at how tall these trees are getting, thanks to the evergreen mod. I, I talked about it before, yeah, but just in case, you know, you skip that episode or something. I have a mod which changes, um, those things very, very visually. My phone rang. Wait a second. Alright, let's do this. I hear the puppies! It is the puppies, right? I mean, it could be a tell for something else, but I'm not too sure. Look at how big this is! This is amazing! Smash me, dream. That's right. You guys, do his name is Moon Pie. That is great. What are the puppies though? They need to show up before you know, before night pops up. Otherwise, these guys will just be wandering around everywhere. Oh jeez. So yeah, we're, like I said before, we're getting lots and lots and lots of logs. Not only so we can replant these trees. But right now, we are in dire need of uh, just more inventory space. I don't want to leave everything on the ground. People steal stuff, you know. Uh, pigs will steal my food. Um, uh, there's probably no immediate moles around my area. But if one, like, does wander around, I don't even know if they are capable of doing that. But if one end up, ends up... Wow, look how tall that thing is! Whoa! Yeah, if one ends up chilling around me, he might steal the marble that I left on the ground. And I'm going to have to go whack a mole. Wow, so much more time in the day. It's great. This is like the best time of spring right now. So good. The puppies are getting louder. Please, let me fight them already. Just, wait. Even if it's a fire one, I'll gladly accept it so we can go ahead and, you know, burn all these trees down and uh, get as much charcoal as I can. It'd be great. Where are they? Come on. I'm ready for a fight. Alright. Pigs doing the thing. Just whacking away with their little hooves. They have little hooves, like they have like pig hooves. Like, I don't even know. I mean, these are man pigs, but look at them. They're so dope. No, they don't get him! Smash! And yeah, he's dead. That's it. That's it. You just drop that. Oh, there's another one. Better grab it before these guys eat it. Cory! You got Cory Moon Pie. Um, I can't read that name, bro. Dumpling and Ella Gablus? Oh my god, Ella Gablus. Christ, monkey balls. Alright. Where is the tree guardian? He should be popping up soon, huh? Oh, is that a frog? I should probably have them attack it, right? Alright, guys, get ready. No, actually, uh, they'll probably attack him on its own. Get on! There you go, see? Smash! Yay! Oh, the pigs! Okay, this is... Oh, this is an ordeal. Alright, the pigs are starting to fight. It's fine. Ooh, look at that. Watch that. Woo, do your thing! And these pigs are dead. And there's gonna be way too many spiders for me to just... Casually walk over there and pick up whatever I want. That's just not gonna happen. Alright, so it's night time. Let's go ahead and focus on building whatever we need. Well, it's not totally night, but... You know, the pigs are done helping me, and if any stragglers come along, then I'll commend them. Pretty awesome. Quick rest. Where'd I get that from? I must have picked it up off the ground. This pedal, too. Oh, well, I was holding a uh, space bar, so probably. Alright, let's put all the food away. Uh, I don't have any more food. I'm gonna eat these for um, health. My sanity is really high. I think I'm gonna eat these, actually. It's gonna help out really, really well. And all I need to do is chill with my guy. With my glomer. Okay. So, let's go and eat these seeds. So, yeah, I'm down on food, but right now we, we have enough inventory space. Ah, I gotta go plant the trees. It's fine. It's still morning. <gasps> Green mushroom. Thank you. Right, let's go plant these things down. Very important that I replant these so I don't have to do it later. And we. Ah, they're still fighting. Huh. Well, perhaps I can stay out here for a while after all. It's just like. Oh, it's, yeah, right. There's like a million spiders here. Holy fuck! What the hell did I do? Ah! Yeah, you, you guys want to mess with me? Is that, is that it? Right, as long as I don't attack one of them, all of them will not chase me. Just the ones in the immediate area. So, leave me alone, you bastards! 
Alright, let the pig go. Um, I can. It, well, we are probably far enough that this is gonna work out. But I think the spiders. I don't know if they'll chase me right away. But I think this is gonna go. Yeah, this is good. Ow, you fudger. Alright, we are good to go. We're gonna make the boxes and all that stuff. So for now, I'm gonna have to end it. If you enjoyed, leave a like. It helps so much. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I put a lot of daily videos. Thank you for being here. More Don't Starve on the way. Look how much wood we have obtained. This is great. Very, very happy to see. We're finally gonna make a lot of chests. Um, here's hoping I can organize it, you know, efficiently. So thanks for being here. And this is what we explored so far. And I shall see you guys next time.